Hi everyone, it's Emilia here. Welcome to my YouTube channel and welcome to another part of uh, Summer with Lemon Craft. In this video I'm going to make two Christmas cards. Theme for this challenge is Christmas in July and I will be using a Christmas collection from Lemon Craft from the last year which is called Christmas Greetings. So I'm starting with A4 card and I um, uh, fold it in half so I need to score at 4 and, and 8 cm and for the one, di one card I'm going to use a die just remember to place the die over the folding um, scoring line and for the other card I'm going to use a CD so if you do not have uh, a die you can use uh, the same technique as I'm using now take a CD, draw uh, around it just leave the space on the top where you need to create uh, the top of the bubble uh, whatever you call it I don't know how you call it but uh, I have uh, just draw that uh, you know piece on the top and now I'm cutting it out quite slowly as I want to do it as um, best as I can so this way I'm going to have two very similar uh, cards and even if you do not have a die I encourage you to make a Christmas bubble shaped card with me as you can see it's not difficult and I'm sure everyone's got some CD at home now I just, uh, I'm just rubbing off that uh, pencil and my cards are ready to decorate I have chosen a few uh, circle dies. I'm going to have two layers on each card, darker on the bottom and lighter on the top. But before I will ad uh, adhere my um, first layer, I want to ink the edges of the cards. And I have uh, chosen the mm, green ink. Any ink will, uh, will be will be fine. You don't have to use green, you could use uh, dark red or uh, even brown. So the first layer I'm going to uh, stick um, on both cards but before I will stick on uh, the second layer I will push the edges of the layer up because I want it to um, to create some kind of dimension so I don't want both layers be uh, sticked on really really flat I have prepared few decorations for my card and I uh, will be using everything what I could find at home I usually uh, collect you know all bits and pieces uh, even from the uh, previous year from Christmas decorations I usually trim mm, everything uh, of what I think that I could use next year so I got the selection of different things here and I will start with a um, cheesecloth to, to go first I want to create kind of snowy background for my composition and I want those uh, cards to be quite fluffy, snowy uh, and very festive so now I'm going to build my compositions and I will turn some music on for you and I will talk to you later enjoy
my cards are almost ready there is few more things I want to do so first I will uh, use a gesso to uh, give it a kind of uh, you know to give it a snowy look then I'm going to uh, um, stick on artificial snow and lots of glitter for for the snow I'm going to use gel medium so just uh, take a paintbrush apply gel medium here and there and then the artificial snow and this uh, snow is the snow I bought last year in um, in the store with uh, with Christmas decorations I think it's only poly uh, balls you know different sizes and I'm sure that you will find it in um, any store nearer Christmas time so uh, I'm going also to uh, sprinkle everything with glitter and uh, that's it actually my cards are ready I hope you like them and I really hope that I will inspire you to create your Christmas cards in July and also to join our um, challenge uh, on the Lemon Craft blog all the links to the products and all the links to the previous challenge you will find below the video let me also remind you that previous challenge was uh, back in time and me and Olga had uh, videos for our project so you can uh, see those too. Thank you very very much for watching. Take care. Bye.